M0FXB, welcome to my channel. Just a quick one. How do I download PyStar for my hotspot? So go to pystar.uk and on the left here there's a drop down menu. Select downloads, then go to download PyStar. And these are the the main ones. If you look down here, most people if you've got a jumbo hotspot on a say Raspberry Pi Zero or a Pi Three, Pi Two, then uh, select not the very bottom one but the one above. Click that, and then it will download a compressed file. When this completes, I'll show you which file is the disk image that needs to go on your SD card. Now it's completed, you just uh, click it. I would show in folder. With, so I would right click and send the whole thing to a file on your computer that you've saved called PyStar. But when you look inside it, the one you actually want, I mean to save the folder, click extract here and it will just send it where you decide. The one you actually want is this middle one, it's called PyStar RPI and this is version 4 because we're February 2021 and it's called a disk image file so once you've got that saved somewhere then you need a program called Bellina Bellina Etcher and that I'll just file that up so you know what it looks like so this is what it looks like and what you do is you select with the first section here flash from file then you select the disk image it goes there and then you select the target which will be your SD card that you've plugged in your PC send that all across when it finishes and completes you then go back to PyStar and then you've got a Wi-Fi what they call a, a, a PyStar tool here called a Wi-Fi builder select that and here where it says SSID and PSK put in the user and password of your router at home I'll just put anything in for now and when you click submit you'll get this file here and now just click it show in folder and before you put the SD card back in your hotspot right click and then click send and send it to your your SD card which will be like an E drive or something like that it'd be a bootable drive uh, there's the link there for the Bellina etcher file and that's it and that will get you get your, your downloaded file for your PyStar and then follow the other videos for setting up PyStar 7.3 all the best